Hey guys, how's it going? I'm walking into a real popular chain store. I'm not trying to give free advertisement to them. They're big enough as it is already. Just here to get some more change. Uh, just another reminder, so on this video, I asked you to please make sure you clean your injector cups out. Uh, make sure they're not damaged, no cracks or any uh, oil ring slip on them. Uh, make sure you do all that before you install your injectors and let's get to the video. Okay, so this is final right here. You already cleaned out your, all your injectors. Uh, what I use is this right here. White lithium grease. I put it on the where the seals go. Once you have cleaned out the injector, uh, you can do a brake cleaner, uh, any kind of solvent. Uh, once you clean it up, just rub it around. This uh, this is not so much so that it makes the gasket feel okay. The whole ring. This is so that it can slide in like a knife into the butter i'm tired guys i just i got off of work today at seven in the morning and i'm still working here gotta get this truck out of here customers being uh, asking me to get it out asap so this is it and right now i'm gonna show you how we're gonna put it in there and you're gonna see how easy how smooth it's gonna go in i'm also gonna show you the torque the torque on this uh 05 international dt466 is 30 pounds uh 30 pounds torque on the uh on the hold down bolt okay so let's do that all right so here we go fixing to put it down with the white lithium grease on it put it down remember we have to line that little uh piece right there with the actual hold down bracket okay So, I think we are in place. No, we're not. How do I know when I'm in place? Well, when the injector starts moving around, which is right there. Right there is when I know I'm, I'm ready to go. So, I'm going to use by hand first of all remember I told you that by hand and you see I'm not sure if you can see how the injector is moving the injector gradually is going down see I told you guys if you guys will make some donations so I can get those glasses you guys will see everything my eyes are seeing. Okay, so right there, gonna use my Milwaukee wrench and I'm gonna drive it in. You're gonna see how smooth it's gonna go in. Uh, if, it, if yours doesn't start going in smooth, stop. You have an issue going on there. Okay, but you guys still focus on the injector. See how it goes down. See how smooth it goes. Okay. Uh, this thing is rated for 55 pounds. Of course, that's what they rated at, right? So. Uh, I kind of give it all the way until it stops. I already have my torque wrench ready to go at 30 pounds. See if you can see that. Now that's uh, your 30 pounds right there. Now I'm fixing to start torquing it. It is kind of hard to do it with one hand, buddy.
This thing finally gave out, I think. Still trying to get 30 pounds, okay? Um, probably not that near there, but it's all pretty, pretty close. So bear with me. Hear that click? 30 pounds. You're all set. So, white lithium grease around your oil rings. Drive it down. If you have a if you have a wrench, minima, minimize, don't put too much. My wrench is rated at 55, but I just punched it to as, as low as I could. Then uh, went around a couple of times and it's torqued down to 30 pounds. 30 pounds of torque that's what the uh, manual ass is for 30 pounds of torque and you're all set injectors all torqued in next step is going to be the high pressure oil rail